In this equation, we have calcium hydroxide and ammonium chloride. We're going to try to balance it. Let's count the atoms up on each side of the equation. One calcium, two times the one oxygen, we have two of those. Two times the one hydrogen, we have two of those. Plus, we have these four hydrogens here. So we have a total of six hydrogen atoms. One nitrogen, and then the one chlorine. On the product side, we have calciums, one oxygens, just the one hydrogens, three, plus we have two over here. So we have five hydrogen atoms, one nitrogen, and then two chlorine atoms. Let's leave the oxygens and hydrogens to last. Uh, start with the chlorine. We have the two here and the one here. So let's put a two in front of the ammonium chloride. So we have one times two for the nitrogen, then the hydrogen, we need to update that number. We have two times the one, so two hydrogens, plus four times two is eight. So now we have 10 hydrogen atoms. Chlorines, one times the two, that'll give us two. So we've balanced the chlorines. Let's do the nitrogens now. We have two here and one here. We put a two in front of the ammonia. Now we have one times two. So that gives us two nitrogens, and we need to update the hydrogen atoms. We have three times two, that's six, plus these two over here. So now we have eight hydrogen atoms. Why don't we update the oxygens next and see how that works out? Because we could put a two in front of the H2O, that even might fix the hydrogens. Let's try it. So we have oxygens, one times two, that gives us two oxygens. Those are balanced. Let's update the hydrogens. We have three times two, six hydrogens, plus two times two, that's four. Six plus four is 10, and that did fix it. We're done. This equation is balanced. The trick here, really leave the hydrogens and oxygens till last. That often makes the balancing easier. And then be careful. You have hydrogens here and hydrogens here. You have to count all those. And on this side, again, you have these hydrogens and these hydrogens. You have to count them all up. This is Dr. B with the balanced equation for CaOH2 plus NH4Cl. And thanks for watching.